watching a master at work. Shut up. So what is color blindness and how glasses work? Light is formed of seven different colors. So when the light falls on the object, the object absorbs one color or more and reflects the rest. The reflected color is the exact color of this object. Let's make it more simple. You have a red apple. The light gets on the red apple and the red apple absorbs all seven colors except the red color which is reflected, so it's the color of the red apple. The reflected color passes via cornea, lens, and then get back to the retina. There are three different cones, cones for red, cones for green, and cones for blue. They are the major colors. Mixing them with different amount of light can give you any color you want. Like mixing color in paints, but it's somehow different. So let's go to physics. Okay, it's hereditary disease. It's a recessive gene carried on X chromosome, so it's X-linked disease. Did you need all your X chromosomes are fit? In the case of man, you have just only one X, so a fraction of one X makes you color blindness patient. In the case of man, you have just only X, so you are affected easily. And in the case of, of women, they have two X, so if she has one X is affected, she is a carrier. But the both X if affected, she is color blind patient. If you use all the types of light cones correctly as trichromosomes, so we have three types of color blindness. Protonomaly, which is reduced sensitivity to red color. Tetranomaly, which is reduced sensitivity to green color. And by the way, it's the most common. Tritonomaly, which is reduced sensitivity to blue color. And it's very rare. Is there anyone can see any color? Yep, they are monochromic people. They see no color at all. And their role is consists of different shades of gray ranging from black to white like old black white TV sets. If you do not have enough of a certain pigment or photopigment, you will have a trouble seeing that color. Most cases of poor color vision involve red-green color deficiency. This means you have trouble distinguishing between some red and green colors, depending on their intensity. And chroma glasses were created for doctors to use during laser surgery procedures. They were originally manufactured as sunglasses with lens coated in special material. The inventor of chroma glasses discovered that that coating on these lenses might also enable people with poor color vision to see the differences in pigment that they couldn't detect before. Search about color blindness and see what they can see and how chroma glasses can solve this problem. Ah! 